today I'm going to show you how to make a flourless chocolate and hazelnut cake. Enjoy watching. So this is all our recipe today for the flourless chocolate and hazelnut cake. And now, let's do it. I've got some hazelnuts here. Uh, they are whole hazelnuts. I didn't get any ground hazelnuts, but we need ground hazelnuts for this recipe. So what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna put this whole hazelnuts into my coffee grinder, which I have here already. Um, and I try to ground it. Let's see if it works. If it doesn't work, we're gonna have a problem. Okay, so what we do next, we're gonna take our chocolate and our butter. We're gonna put the butter and the chocolate into a metal bowl. And I've prepared already a pot with boiling water and I'm just gonna put it on there so it all melts together. All right, perfect. My butter and chocolate is melting away on a very, very low temperature um, on my stove. And now I'm gonna continue with the rest. All right, next up is separating my eggs. Okay, we give this a little stir. Eggs are separated, can you see? No, you can't. I'm dripping it everywhere. Next step will be getting my beast mixer. What we're going to do now, we take our egg white and all of the sugar. We're just gonna whip that up to a soft peak. Okay, when you whip up your egg white, always make sure your bowl is properly clean. Um, if it's dirty, if there's any dust or any other dirt, it will not work and your egg white doesn't uh, whip up properly. Not quite done yet. That was about 5 to 10 minutes. Okay, egg white is done. One good trick to know how, when your egg white is done is if you take the bowl and you put it <laughs> just over you. Oh my god. Then you know it's done. Done. <laughs> We're gonna take our egg yolks and we're just gonna mix that into the egg white very, very carefully and for about a minute, um, just so it's combined basically. Okay, so that's combined now. Egg white and egg yolk. Now it's a lot more liquid. I wouldn't recommend putting it over your head now. I just wouldn't recommend it. We've got our chocolate and butter. This is nice and smooth. This is really good stuff. We're gonna put the rum into the chocolate. Every last drop of it. All right, then we mix it. After chocolate, rum and butter, we're gonna mix our hazelnuts in there. The only thing left to do is combining both together. And this is what we're going to do now. Chocolate, egg white, egg yolk, in there. Okay, then I have already made a cake tin, which I've got over here. I've put some greaseproof paper in. And now I'm gonna fill my ready mix, my ready cake mix, I'm gonna fill into my tin. This is what it looks like. All right, perfect. Um, cake is done, mixture's done, now it's ready for the oven. I preheated my oven to 180 degrees. And I'm gonna put the time somewhere down below. Stick the knife in the middle of the cake. If it comes out clean, the cake is done. Perfect, this is exactly what we want it to look like. Uh, now we just need to leave it to cool down and then we're gonna put the glaze on it. Okay, and at last we're gonna take the cake out of the cake tin, we put the chocolate on top and then we're just gonna sprinkle some of the hazelnuts on top. Check it out. This is it. This is my recipe of my flawless chocolate and hazelnut cake. 
I hope you enjoy it.